President Uhuru Kenyatta's meeting in Migori was cut short when a group of rowdy youths reportedly opposed to Governor Okotho Bado started chanting anti-government slogans and throwing objects. Trouble started when the youths started murmuring claiming they did not want the governor to address the gathering. In the wake of the noise, several local dignitaries, including Jack Ranguma, Governor Kisumu, and Senator Wilfred Mashage, tried to calm the crowds in vain. It was at this point that the head of state stepped in and warned the youths against being purveyors of political hatred. The president. <laughs> Nimetendea wa Kenya pahali popote walipo wale ambao walinichagua na wale ambao hawakunichagua hiyo ni jukumu langu na lazima hiyo jukumu ni itende au namna gani si ni hivyo wenzangu kwa hivyo hiyo program ambayo tumeanza hapa na zile zingine ambazo tutaendelea kuzifanya mimi nawauliza wananchi tuungane tushirikiane tuheshimiane tujue Kenya hii ni yetu sisi zote eh ni kama anu hiyo namna hiyo ni namna hiyo the president challenged leaders to learn to tolerate and respect one another saying politics ended with elections and that democracy is pegged on convergence of divergent views haswa vijana wetu mjue ya kwamba viongozi wakishamaliza kumwaga yale ambao wamemwaga baadaye wanatoka hapo wanaenda kukunywa chai pamoja tunaelewana tunaelewana wale ambao wanawacho wakiumia ni wale wananchi ambao wamechukua hiyo sumu ambayo imetoka katika mdomo ya mwanasiasa na wanaenda kupigana mashinani kwao na hawa ndiyo wanatakikana kuwa wanaishi pamoja. The head of state said voters made decisions during the last general elections and those elected should be given room to deliver on their pledges. The president was in Migori where he launched a 7 billion shillings mosquito net distribution campaign that will cover 25 malaria prone counties. ODM has since distanced itself from the hooligans urging its supporters to always accord the head of state the respect he deserves. Through a statement, ODM Secretary General Anyang Nyongo said it condemns the behavior in the strongest terms possible. For Channel 1 News, I'm Ron Cliff. Audit.